Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you fix check your notification on another device Facebook to a factor authentication problem. Before we start, hurry up and check all the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, if you're wondering how do you fix this issue here on your Facebook account. So typically when you try to log in into your account, it sometimes it's going to say check your notification on another device. So typically what you need to do here is you just need to basically you need to basically approve the login here. So for example, if you uh, if you're trying to log into a different phone here, but you're already logged in in a in a different device that is locked in first. So that, if that makes sense. So for example, if first logged in in one device and you've logged in or you're trying to log in in this device here it will actually send a notification that you need to approve this specific login which is something a hassle since you need to check the other device for you to approve that so typically you just need to open up facebook here so just give you the uh, when you access facebook here it's going to give you the pop-up for approving the login so you could also visit the notifications here it's going to say someone's trying to log in let us know if it's you so once you, once you actually click on that pop-up here it's j you just need to basically click on the yes it's me and that would actually approve the login here now in this case once you click on the approve login here it will actually approve the actual login but in just just in case like for example you you aren't able to access the other device that is that actually sent the approval here you could go ahead and click on try another way here and basically choose other ways for you to basically log in so you can actually use whatsapp or text message here if you want so in this case you could go ahead and choose one of them and just basically click on the continue button here and this will actually use the other way which in this case your mobile number which in this case you could go ahead and just wait for the text message to arrive and type it out in here in the code section and basically continue with logging in now you could also enable the trust this device option here if you want to so in this case go ahead and click on allow here to use that code and just basically enter our code here now once you've entered your code that would actually log you in into your account so just give you an example let's go and click on continue here now in this case, once you've logged in, you can go and click on save or not now. And again, you should be able to access your account. But in some cases, just in case you aren't able to use the other way here and you don't want to always use the uh, notification way here, you can actually add two-factor dedication here on your account. So you just need to open up Facebook here and you want to go to your homepage here and access the uh, gear icon at the top right of your uh profile so go to your profile at the top right here click on the year icon at the top right again and you want to go to see more account center and you want to go to password and security specifically it's going to be under two factor authentication you want to access your facebook account here and from here you just want to add your mobile number so in this case you could go ahead and just basically choose sms or whatsapp enter your mobile number here you can change your phone mobile number as well if you want to but if you haven't added any mobile number you have the option to add your mobile number here but in this case, uh, yeah, so that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.